Hey guys, so today I want to talk about CTE Blade A2S new smartphone. CTE Blade A2S is a new phone from CTE that comes with a bit smaller screen than what we usually have seen in 2017. Many new phones this year had uh, has had at least 5.5 inch display. This phone comes with just 5.2 inch display, main specs, fingerprint, 5.2 inch display, 3 GB RAM, 32 GB internal storage, MT6753 octa core processor, 4G connectivity, 128 GB TF car support, fast fingerprint ID, uh, metal body, 2.5D curved design, and 13 megapixel camera. Blade A2S looks a little bit like Huawei Mate 9 on the back design. It comes with a 5 megapixel front facing selfie camera. You can insert two nano SIM cards, perfect for a vacation. The phone is running on Android 6.0 and the processor is clocked at 1.3 gigahertz. I don't see the major selling point with this smartphone when you can get Xiaomi Redmi Note 5A for just a little higher price. It has a pretty slim thickness, just 7.5 millimeter, and the weight is 145 grams. The battery inside packs 2,540 milliamp battery, which is not the best. I have seen many phones for around this price that comes with 3,000 milliamp battery installed. You can't remove the battery. It's nice that it packs a metal build instead of a plastic build, and also good how it comes with a 3.5 millimeter earphone jack, something many new phones doesn't have pre-installed. Two colors are available, gold and gray. Blade A2S seem to have a home button installed, but it doesn't look like you can push it down as a hardware button, so probably just a glass button. The front design reminds me about iPhone 4S, but uh, without a home button. The gold edition definitely looks the best out of the two, but I still feel like it's something missing here to make you truly want to invest and buy the phone. 